Jump 4 is written in C++. What it really means is that its source code contains a bunch of text files written in very specific format, which is human readable. Our computer does not understand this at all. What it really understands is something like this. The process to convert the human readable source code to something that the machine can understand is called compilation. The source code can be compiled into two different things. The first is called an executable. In a Windows machine, you can double click on its icon and run it. In the command line, you can use it as a command. The second thing is called a library. A library cannot be run directly. However, a library contains functions that can be called by an executable. GM4 is provided as a toolkit. What it really means is that after its installation, you should not expect to see an executable that you can double click and run it. Instead, you're gonna get a bunch of library files which can be called by an executable compiled from a user program. Libraries compiled in a Windows machine cannot be used in Linux or Mac, vice versa. However, libraries compiled in one Windows machine may be used by another Windows machine as long as the versions of the Windows and the compilers are the same. This is true for Mac and Linux as well. If you use one of the operating systems listed here, you may not need to compile GM4 at all. Instead, you just need to download the pre-compiled libraries from the GM4 website and start to use it right away. I have to warn you though, the pre-compiled libraries do not contain some of the optional GM4 features. If you'd like to use a specific GM4 feature that is not included in the pre-compiled libraries, such as the user interface based on Qt, you will have to download the GM4 source code and compile it by yourself. The official GM4 installation guide that is available from the GM4 website describe in detail how can you compile GM4 in different operating systems. There is also a short YouTube video that explains well how do you compile GM4 in command line. In our class, however, we're going to focus on the installation of pre-compiled GM4 in Windows and Mac since it's a much faster process which allows us to focus on some important aspects of the GM4 installation.